Hello, my loves. Welcome to your love reading for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. I hope everyone is safe, happy, healthy, and doing well. Holy Spirit, Angel Spirits and Guides, Clarity, Guidance, and Love Messages. Clarity, Guidance, and Love Messages for my Sagittarians, please. Holy Spirit, Angel Spirits and Guides, Clarity, Guidance, Love Messages for my Sagittarius, please. What do my Sagittarians need to know, please, Spirit, in this upcoming Mercury Retrograde? What do my Sagittarians need to know, please, in this upcoming Mercury Retrograde, please, Holy Spirit? What do my Sagittarians need to know, please, for this upcoming Mercury Retrograde, please, Holy Spirit? Clarity, Guidance, Love Messages for my Sagittarians. So we have the Nine of Swords, the Judgment card, Sagittarian Energy, the World card, and the Page of Wands, Sagittarian Energy. Could be dealing with a Leo or an Aries. We've got the Full card, Aries Energy, the Three of Cups, the Nine of Cups, and the King of Wands more Sag and energy lovers card Gemini strength card Leo ace of swords and the four of wands so Sag I feel like someone here really wants a second chance someone here really wants a second chance um you may be telling them that it's over you may be telling them that it's over or you may be telling them that there's a lot of shit that needs to change because you're not going back to the way things were okay um i feel like someone is taking the risk someone wants to come together they want to reconcile someone here is willing to give wish fulfillment someone here is willing to you know go above be and beyond to make the other person happy um if there's a third party in the picture i feel like someone here will be withdrawing from any other third parties or anybody that's trying to come in between this connection i do feel like someone truly wants commitment and stability here Sag. okay um we have the eight of pentacles we have the ace of cups and we have the three of pentacles. Yes, yeah, someone here is even willing to go to like a, a marriage counselor or a couples counselor or something. Someone here is willing to do whatever it takes to get a new beginning in love here, to rekindle this love. Someone really wants to work on this, Sag. We've got the Knight of Wands, Leo, Sag, Aries energy. We have the Moon, Cancer, Pi. Oh, there was a third party. Sag, for whoever I'm reading here, whoever I'm, I'm reading for, there was a third party. There was a secret here. Someone here was secretly talking to someone else, going to meet someone else. Someone here is getting caught cheating. Now, if it isn't sexual cheating, it's an energy of someone here was maybe talking behind someone's back. You know what I'm saying? Um, we've got the Emperor, Aries, Taurus energy, the Ten of Swords, and the King of Pentacles. Someone here is dead set on a divorce or someone is dead set on this connection being over. Someone really is holding their ground. Someone doesn't want this anymore. Someone here is, is not really in a forgiving mood, to be honest with you. We've got the Page of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces energy, the Eight of Wands, the Empress, and the Two of Cups. Someone wants to come in and apologize. They want to make this work. They want to move forward with higher levels of commitment. Someone here wants this relationship to move forward. But with the Seven of Wands, the Two of Pentacles, Temperance, and the King of Cups, Cap uh, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces energy, I feel like someone doesn't want it because they're like, you know what? I don't want to live the rest of my life not knowing if I can trust you or not. I want peace in my life. I want to know that the person that I'm with loves me and that's it. You understand what I'm saying? Trust has been destroyed in this connection. The trust has been destroyed in this connection. We've got the Knight of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo energy. We have the Three of Swords, and we have the Ace of uh, the Eight of Swords. So, 
Sag, I feel like there's this energy of someone's like, I knew it. I felt it all along that something was happening behind my back. I just knew it. And it may be, you know, that this, you were in this energy for a long time that your intuition was telling you that something was happening behind your back. Maybe, you know, someone was calling you crazy. Like, you know, cause that eight of swords talks about being in a mental prison, right? So someone here, maybe I'm saying it's all in your head. It's all in your head. It's all in your head. But you know, you're finding out the truth here. We've got the Ten of Pentacles and the Four of Swords. Um, I feel like you tried to relax. You tried to just, you know, heal and not think about it. You tried to just have a happy relationship. You tried to let this go, but your intuition was kicking off, man. Yeah, your intuition was telling you to leave something behind, that something wasn't right here. We've got the Six of Cups and we've got the Queen of Cups right next to the King of Cups. I feel like someone here is still attached to someone from their past. King and Queen of Cups, there's still love between this ex and your person. There's still love there, okay? There's still love there. We've got the Six of Wands, and we have the Ten of Wands. I feel like... I feel like where once you were proud of this connection, you wanted to win at this connection, you were proud of this person, now you're feeling over... Like, now it's just whatever this person did, it's too much for you to handle. Okay, it's just way too much for you to handle. We've got the Ace of Pentacles, we have the Nine of Wands, and we have the Seven of Swords. I feel like this person would do anything. They would do anything to get a second chance with you, Sag. But this, you know, you they hurt you. That this person really, really hurts you, and they would do anything. They would buy you anything. They would propose marriage. You're looking at this offer, Sag, but you you're like it's not real. It's not real. It's not real. I don't know if I can trust you or not. I don't know if what you're saying is real. I don't know if you really love me or not. I don't, I just don't know. We've got the Knight of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces energy. And we have the Hanged Man, more Piscean energy. Yeah, I feel like this offer is going to come in, Sag. I feel like this apology is going to come in. You just don't know if you can trust it. You really don't know if you can trust it. We've got the Devil, Capricorn energy, and the Five of Cups. Someone here is becoming obsessive um, with guilt. Someone here is losing their mind with guilt. Losing their mind with guilt. Could be dealing with the Capricorn. We've got the Knight of Swords, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra energy, and the Four of Pentacles. Some of you may actually have to call the cops to get this person away from you. Some of you may have to uh, put a restraining order on somebody, I'm hearing. The more you pull away from this person, the more they want you. The more they want to make this work. We've got the Seven of Pentacles. And we've got the Queen of Swords. You don't trust this person enough to invest in this connection anymore, Sag. You just don't trust this person enough to invest in this connection anymore. We've got the Tower, Aries, Scorpionic Energy, and the Five of Wands. I feel like a huge fight is going to break out. And that's coming right on top of that Knight of Swords energy, which I'm seeing cops. Some of you may have, have cops that are being called. We've got the Hierophant, Taurus Energy, and the Nine of Pentacles, Virgo Energy, Pre-Empress Energy. I feel like someone here is about to go from married or engaged or, or in a very high level of commitment to single very quickly. I feel like the ball's about to drop very quickly here. We have the Ten of Cups, and we've got the Queen of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo energy, with the Justice card, Karma, Libra energy. One more on this. And the Five of Swords. Yeah, someone here was being manipulative. Someone here was playing games. Someone here maybe was in a higher level of commitment elsewhere. And someone is being caught playing games here. We've got the Chariot. And we've got the Six of Swords. Yeah, someone here made a decision. Someone here made a decision to play games. They made a decision to play games. And they're losing because you're walking away from this. You're Yeah, see the Death card. This is over. Scorpionic Energy. Someone here was, in fact, in a higher level of commitment or someone here quite possibly um, maybe told you that they were leaving their ex-husband or leaving their ex-wife or, you know what I'm saying? And um, maybe they got caught speaking to this person. There's still love in this ex situation. There's still love with this ex and the truth is about to come out here. Okay, the truth is about to come out. All right, guys, I love you and take care. Bye.